So Rosenberg uh, sends me a text message and it says, read this. Yes. Uh, and this is a message from Nori, a Nori, yeah. a text message. Yeah. F you and <laughs> F you and F your politics. You blame it on blank and get security ASAP. Yeah. Might need it. You oh. might need it. Then Not it says, a and it says, it's all you, mother effer. I right. never had any problems with Hot Nine Morning Show until you came along. Uh. You crossed me. Uh. Have fun. Wait, this uh. is real. You sent that to me. Yeah, no, absolutely. Listen, and I also apologize for it, but I told he you, I said it's fifty percent apology because <laughs> I really do mean this. Because the thing is, I don't know if I can name names, so I won't. But every morning show in the past, I have been a part of the morning show. Mm-hmm. I'm a charismatic character. You know what I'm saying? I know how to you put me in the right position i know how to handle myself i'm not going to curse i'm not going to do dumb things and i just always want to be a part of it this is where i built my career mm-hmm. you understand what i'm saying i know the warm line by heart i know 1-800-223-9797 by heart you understand what i'm saying so i be wanting to be a so part ever of ever since this. rosenberg came along ever he since Ro- and he's my friend i've smoked in his house <laughs> He, like, this is- he invited me to his wedding. I invited him to our wedding. I like this guy. But when it comes to business, I don't like you when it comes to business, too, a little bit. You my me? man. Yes, I've got to be honest. That's why she's the only one who gets flowers. She was the only. Aww, I swore the, the flowers. flowers would be for me. You said you booked a flight just to come up here from your vacation with your family. Everyone. Coming to New York. Okay. Be on the show. Yeah. Next thing we know, you want some other radio station. See, what Rosenberg didn't tell you is I was here last week. Hit him Tuesday. Rosenberg didn't respond to me till a Saturday, which to me, so Rosenberg. L- l- listen, I like Rosenberg personally, but when it comes to business, he's not the best oh, God. because he he's ho- right. He's right. He hollered at me four days later, which to me, when you holler at me on a Saturday, that's a kind of a sucker move because you're, oh. you're kind of saying I don't really want you on the show, right? Because if you would have hollered at me on a Tuesday or on a Thursday when David Banner was up here, oh. you could have you could have easily said come up to the show, and I have no you know quarrels or beef with. David Banner, but this is my city. I would not be able to go to Mississippi and say, I'm on the show, and then David Banner called the local radio station and say, yo, I would like to come to the show, and you think they wouldn't bump me out the way? Nori, step out. David Banner's coming in. <laughs> you know that's right. what it is. Look, at the end of the day, I'm not asking for spins. I'm not. I'm asking to be a part of what's going on, which I've been a part of. So if... If, if you feel I'm I, I'm not going to give a great interview or I'm not going to be up here entertaining, then that's something totally different. I got to respect that. But when I offer my hands... Sorry, can I ask you a question? Hand, don't say hands because you're going to throw the when hands. I, when I offer my services and then my <laughs> services isn't, you know what I'm saying, uh, recognized and then something else happens, I don't feel I should be... Saif, over the years... I should be, you know, castrated for it. Who do you think, Saif, over the years has brought up the suggestion of having Nori... On the show, I know, but that's why it would, that's why what you seem, um, that's why it makes you seem so much full of crap because you do, because <laughs> you say that, you say that, but then, like, like me personally, like if I believe in something, I want to stand by it and I want to actually make it happen. You know what I'm saying? I've tried. So, I know, but and and. Psh, it just seems like it's you. And then like, what happened now? Then right. even when it was all done, mm-hmm. our boss leaves it in my hands and goes, listen, right. I will shut him down right. or right. it's up to you. I went, right. no, don't do that. Let me get him. Can we get him on here still? So, and that's what at happened. The, at the end of the day, it was probably you. Who, it was you who shut it down. Still like, <laughs> say, just, let's just be clear. Like, let, like, me ask you, let me ask you a question, uh-huh. Nori. So uh-huh. after you said that Rosenberg needs to get security, Thank you guys no, had no, but some text messages but back and forth. The thing is, what, what did we, Rosenberg say to you? What, we, what we're missing is this is not the first time. Okay. This, you understand? Oh, this is I, not the first this time. This is not the first time I tried to be a part of this. I hit him uh, last year around the same time. I wanted to come up, I wanted to do it. Boom, 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 boom. You had Mob Deep come up here. Like, I'm a human being at the end of the day. Mm-hmm. When I ask for something and then you put somebody in my place, whether you're looking at it like that or not, at the end of the day, I'm a man. So I'm sitting back and I'm saying, holy moly guacamole. This dude just don't got respect for me. Right. But Prodigy you know what I'm just gotten out of jail. That's I don't why. care if Prodigy just got raped by Jesus Christ. Whoa. Whoa. You feel me? <laughs> now that's a story. 